volcanic eruption has given birth to an island in the sea, south of Tokyo. The eruption of the undersea volcano sent smoke billowing 600 meters into the air. After the smoke had cleared, the Japanese Coast Guard saw an island around 650 feet in diameter emerge under a plume of ash. The government has said despite the newly formed island being more than 1,000 kilometers south of Tokyo, it would still technically be part of the city, adding to one of Japan's some 6,000 islands. If our territory can expand, then all the better. If this island can become a proper island, then that would indeed mean that our territory would get larger. There is, however, some uncertainty to whether the island will survive or, like others, will disappear back into the ocean. In the past, there have been these instances caused by undersea volcanoes. But those islands that have previously been caused by undersea volcanoes then sank back into the ocean again. So this time we're just going to wait and see what happens. The last time that volcanoes were known to erupt in this area was in the mid-1970s. However, there is still believed to be much volcanic action that occurs under the sea in the Marianas Trench, the deepest part of the world's ocean, nearly 11 kilometres in depth.